wish to succeed as a jester, you'll need to consider each person's auricular. What is all right for B would quite scandalize C, for C is so very particular. And D may be dull and E's very thick skull is as empty of brains as a ladle. While F is F sharp and will cry with a carp that he's known your best joke from his cradle. When you're humour they flout, you can't let yourself go and it does put you out when a person says, oh, I've known that old joke from my cradle. If your master is surly from getting up early and tempers are short in the morning, an inopportune joke is enough to provoke him to give you a once a month's warning. Then if you refrain, he is at you again, for he likes to get value for money. He'll ask then and there, with an insolent stare, if you know that you're paid to be funny. It adds to the task of a merry man's place when your principal asks with a scowl on his face. If you know that you're paid to be funny.